Right now here is a interesting little shot. What I've got is about 10, 20, 35 yards to the front edge and then it's got to run about 10. Now what I'm going to do, instead of landing it on the green, which is what everybody tries to do normally, is play a little runner. A great little summer shot. I've got a 9 iron and what I'll try and do is land it about 5 or 10 yards short and then run it on. You see then it's very safe shot. Now what you've got to do with, in terms of strategy with all the short game is always pick a point where you want the ball to land and the nearer you can get that to you the better. The more the ball runs the better. I mean, um, It's just an easier shot. Now with the 9-9 you'd expect it to run about half-half and that's exactly what that one's going to do. See, I'm glad, thanks, thank you for the tire for being in the way. But what you'll get is a, is a low running shot. That's generally the best way. Certainly really close to the greens. This, this is 35 yards away. But once you get to within um, 5 yards of the green, 10 yards of the green, even just off the green, the thing to do is to land the ball just on the green, like 2 or 3 yards on the green, and then choose the right club to get the ball to roll out. Now, so you pick your landing point. Now in this instance, from just this area here, I can't putt it because the grass is too thick. What I'll do is try and land it two or three yards on the green and then choose the right club to send the ball the right distance. So let's say from here to my landing point, I'm going to put a yellow ball down. That would be my landing point. And so from this sort of position, I'd land it on the yellow ball and then I'd want it to run maybe half-half, 50-50. So a 9-iron or a pitching wedge would be perfect for that. If I wanted to run the ball all the way up to the, the far end of the green there, I'd still land it on the same place. But instead of having a 9-iron, which would never get up that slope and would never run far enough, um, I would take a 7-iron or even a 6-iron or sometimes a 5-iron, even, even, even with a two-tiered green where you've got to get the ball really running, uh, a f even a chip with a 5-iron from just off the green. And of course, if this is where the hole is and you've got to carry something like that bunker or I'm chipping from here, then I'd need more loft. So then I'd be inclined to take a wedge or a sand wedge because I'd want the ball to stop. So what you do is you choose the landing point and you hit to the landing point, not to the target. The target isn't in your head really. The target becomes the place where you want the ball to land and that makes the whole job a lot easier. Thank you.